Hey, did you quite welcome back? I'm sort of is and worth it. So the episode we got this cool amazing runner here, and basically what this is is a external camera capture card. If you see the one that we got right here from this brand, and they call it the Cam Link 4K, they do have a lot of other versions available, like the Cam Link Pro and etc. The one that we got right here supports 1080p and 4K. And if you guys are curious about what is the benefit of using one of these products, it basically allows you guys to use like your action camera, your DSLR, or any other camera, so that way you can use it for streaming. So the reason why I got this product is because I just started streaming recently and I'm starting to learn a little bit about everything in terms of what you guys can use and how it's beneficial for like using different tools and accessories. I started out using my iPhone to record stuff and I feel like the quality on there wasn't as good. So I wanted to use my camera to start recording stuff. And the only way for me to do that is by using one of these capture cards. And if you guys are curious about the software that I use to stream stuff, I do use OBS. But first I'm actually open up to show you guys what the product looks like inside first. So once you guys take it out, there's a box inside. And once you guys open up, this is what the inside looks like. So inside they do probably got this USB cable. They also probably got a little sticker. And they also probably got the user manual to teach you guys how to use it. And then last but not least, we do have the capture card right here. You can see how it should label Cam Link. And then this part right here is USB, where the other side is HDMI. So when you guys use this product, you do need to use like an HDMI cable. And I do have an HDMI to micro HDMI cable. Let me actually show you guys what I mean. So see right here, we do have the HDMI to micro HDMI cable. Let me see from this angle, you can see what she looks like. And what I'm planning to do is actually use my Sony ZV-1 and use it to stream stuff on like Amazon Live or some other platform onto my laptop. And that way it allows my camera to work as a webcam, which is kind of cool. And the cool thing about this product allows you guys to use it for like PC or Mac. So it doesn't matter what kind of device you guys are using it on, but that is everything that's on the product. Now I'm just plug it in to test it out to see how it works and when actually it works. And it will come back and talk more product in a second. All right, so I got everything all set up. You can see I do have the cam link all plugged in and right here I do have the cable and for the cable I have it plugged into my Sony ZV-1 so if I look at my laptop I do have my OBS on and right here I do have the camera setting so I click on it I want to click on device then I want to click on cam link 4k and if you can see the image on here projected from the actual camera and the cool thing about using a professional camera is the fact that the image quality or the video quality will look a lot better than what you guys are using on your phone or even from the laptop camera so I changed the camera on here let me show you what it actually looks like All right, so you see there's definitely a huge difference when you guys use this one versus the camera quality. So I change it back. This is what the product looks like. So that is basically how you guys do set the product. If you can see it definitely does work. So if you guys want to use it for like streaming or whatever, you can definitely use it how you guys want to. And you do have the option to use it for any of your other cameras. If I wanted to use it for my camera that I'm recording right now, I can use that as well. But this is what the whole setup looks like when you guys actually use it. If you can see it definitely does work. All right, welcome back guys. So now it's a quick test of product and definitely actually does work and should work quite well. So if you guys are planning to do live streaming on some kind of platform, where it be like Amazon Live or somewhere else, and if you guys want to use like a DSLR or some kind of point and shoot camera like the one that I have right here with the Sony ZV-1, you definitely want to invest in some kind of video capture card, whether it's this one or other one out in the market, that is up to you guys. There is plenty of other cheaper options available, but I went for this one like I mentioned because it is a well-known brand. But let me see when I actually use the product, it definitely works pretty well. So now I can start doing live stream with my Sony ZV-1 camera or my DSLR camera and the list goes on. But that is everything that's on the product. Now to unboxing and test the product. Now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for this product, I do have to say that it is pretty worth it if you guys want to need one of these. Especially like I mentioned, if you guys are trying to use like your DSR camera or point and shoot camera and use that video quality onto your computer for like live stream or whatever, then definitely getting one of these is actually pretty worth it. But then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't want or have one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else actually doing it. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.